It is September the 5th, 2021. I'm Andy, and this is the Menorcan Mullet Report from the Golden Ray Rec Site in St. Simon Sound. And today, they completed the final cut on the Golden Ray Rec. I got out this morning uh, just about daybreak. Sun was just coming up off into the east, and yeah, as we got around the corner, we could see that they indeed had completed the cut and were beginning the lift of uh, the section. And, y'all, this has just been uh, a great sight. I've been looking for this to happen for so long to get this get this cut made. Um, we know now that the ship will be gone completely um, here in the near future and maybe we can start getting back to normal here uh, in the in coastal Georgia at St. Simon Sound and trying to get uh, everything back to as normal as, as we recall. So what we're going to do here is uh, just kind of let the video kind of run. Uh, we kind of sped it up in a couple places, but we just kind of made, made a trip around so that you guys could could take a look at this last section while this lift was ongoing, and um, and look at this this piece, which uh, I think this is section five uh, on the uh, straps, and uh, section four is still uh, in the water. And after they get section five up on one of the dry dock sections, uh, they'll be over uh, lifting on section four to get it up and get it ready to go on a section. I'm not really sure how long it's going to take to get get this piece up on a dry dock. Um, we'll have more, more coming up about that uh, in the end of the video, some stuff that we found when we uh, started making a, a trip around uh, after the lift was, was up a little more. Uh, found it kind of interesting. But enjoy these videos. This has been a long time coming.
Now we did see a little bit of oil in the water, uh, but we nothing like we've seen before uh, with the last cut. Um, this was uh, very light in comparison. Uh, they did have the cleanup crews and the debris boats out. As soon as the sun uh, got up a little bit, these guys were out there pulling absorbent um, over some of those areas. And then and we got a little video here uh, with the helicopter kind of spotting the operation while the guys were out working the site. Now, this is what we wanted to show you um, as this lift was coming up. And I want you to pay a closer attention to that lower left-hand corner of this section. And you can see how those decks are kind of crushed and how they're kind of started to fold over. Now, this was a big concern uh, with a lot of engineers that contacted us during this project and uh, said that uh, very well uh, could see a collapse of, of this ship uh, just by the way they're structured, constructed and the amount of weight that was sitting on it. And this is really an eye opener to see this and how these decks started to fold over. Again, this side was kind of leaning into this. This side was kind of taking the brunt of the weight and we can see what kind of damage was going on there. Well, a little bit of rain out on the site today. And as we were just getting ready to pull off, we kind of looked over and there right in the center of the screen you can see a faint rainbow kind of developing and we thought you know <laughs> what an awesome sight to see here on the day they complete the last cut and they start the lift of that section to have this rainbow pop out here over the wreck site at the saint simon sound Well, that's going to do it for the report today. We're still going to be monitoring the site. Uh, we still got another section to get lifted and some stuff going on in the port. So we're going to continue uh, to bring that bring that to you. Uh, we, we hope that if you like what you see, you'll hit the subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Keep on sending the comments. And most of all, we want you guys to stay safe out there.